Hello guys, this is Obob Gaming here and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to download Dota 1 or Warcraft 3 Frozen Throne Maps 2023. Okay, so all you need to do is to follow these steps and these are not very confusing and this could be very useful for all of you guys who loves Dota 1. Okay, so um, all we need to do is to open the Google Chrome first, of course and then we have to go to epicwar.com so that is the official website and as you can see I already searched for custom hero survivor um, there's already a bunch of results coming out and um, if you want a specific map that you want to play um, all you need to do is to go to this section right here which is the search bar and all, we, all you need to do is to type in the maps that you actually prefer okay so um, right now I'm just going to try element TD 9.4 okay so let's search it up alright so here are the results and um, this is this is actually the one that I'm looking for the element TD survivor 9.4 and all you need to do is to click this section right here which is the download element TD 9.4.w3x okay alright so since I already clicked it and you will see this prompt over here but um, it often um, happens sometimes but um, not all the time okay so when you receive this forbidden message do not panic all you need to do is to go to this link right here and as you can see there are actually two percentage symbols and you need to change it up to underscore okay so I'm just gonna type it right here underscore and there's the other one another percentage symbol okay so I'm just going to hit enter since I'm already done and we cannot see any other percentage symbol on this link okay so I'm gonna hit enter and boom as you can see um, the map has already been downloaded even if it's in a forbidden message it says here that I don't have any permission but I already downloaded it just by using that simple step okay so um, all we need to do um, right over here is to show in folder and we're going to copy this map and paste it onto our Warcraft maps so here's the copy and I have my Warcraft 3 file ready here and go to this map section or map maps folder okay double click it and then paste it right over here downloads okay so I'm just going to paste the map right over here which is okay so what I usually do to make it easy for me to locate the maps that I um, already downloaded or I recently just downloaded is to create a new file folder so I do have here my test folder which is um, the folder that I do put my maps in in order for me to locate the maps easily so um, that's my another tip for you guys for you to locate the maps easily okay so I'm just gonna paste it over here as well okay so as you can see um, I already have mine pasted it's actually on uh, three element TD since um, I'm just this um, demonstrating it to you guys and later on I'm just going to delete it right on my end okay so since we already have the maps downloaded I'm just going to go to the Warcraft tree game okay alright so there's a prompt right there and it's still loading okay click local area network and make sure to put up your player name put something any any names for you to be able to proceed or you could choose a single player section and this is what I'm talking about since um, there's a lot of maps right over here and you cannot easily locate the map that you recently downloaded 
that's why I'm recommending you guys to create a new file folder for you to put the maps that you downloaded just recently okay so since I already downloaded mine on this test folder I'm just going to double click it and here you go there's actually three results since I already did this um, download thing on my end um, before okay so there you have it all you need to do is to go to epicwar.com and if you see the forbidden message change the percentage symbol to um, underscore okay all right so thank you so much guys for watching that is just a quick tip for you to download maps easily in warcraft 3 or dota 1 maps and i do appreciate your time thank you so much and please subscribe to my channel for more warcraft 3 content bye bye